Hello, Cancer. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly reading for the week of August 7th through the 13th, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish, and I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Um, Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising. All right, let's go. So, what's going on for cancer, cancer, cancer? What's going on for cancer for the week of 7, 13, August 7th through 13th, 2017? Love reading. August 7th through 13th, 2017. Love reading. Do, 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 do. Okay. Okay, somebody is starting to look like is is everything really worth it? Somebody is looking at the whole relationship like, hmm, should I be here? Oh yeah. Yeah, somebody is like really thinking about this tough, like what is going on here? Do I deserve this? Do I want to be here? You know? Somebody was real deep deep into thought about this relationship. Um, this can sometimes, let's see, because sometimes this can mean somebody is like emotionally draining you. But I'm feeling both ways here, even though it's upright. Okay, maybe somebody feel like you're emotionally draining, but for the most part, this could be a give and take relationship. Oh, this makes me feel like uh, your partner or you feel like your partner cares about somebody else. But it seems like y'all got a fairly neutral relationship when it comes to feeling wise. Okay, there's some secrets coming out and they might have to do with this. You think your partner. All right, what are these secrets about for the cancer? Eight. 7 through 13, 2017. Mm. All right, so somebody got a secret about work. What's the secret about work for cancer? Or somebody that makes more money or more powerful. All right. Okay, this makes me feel like somebody getting physical with somebody at work. Okay. Yeah, this makes me feel like it might be you. You in this relationship, you're like, oh, you know, I think they're dealing with their ex, but they don't, you're only thinking this because in the past you were sleeping with somebody at your job. Maybe one of your workers. And now you got suspicions that your partner is um, messing with somebody else. All right, what is this? 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 All right, so somebody is thinking about timing out. Yeah, so your partner is thinking about timing out from you because I think they 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 sick of the accusal, but you only accuse because you feel guilty of what you've done in the past. Okay. All right, it's telling you to keep going. All right, let's. What do you need to keep going? What? Does the cancer need to keep going about? What's going on with this cancer? Why do they need to keep going? Okay. So it's basically saying you need to keep going with whatever the shortest situation. So it might seem like this person is messing with somebody else. You need to keep this mind process, but I feel like they only doing it, doing it because of the situation that you've had in the past. Yeah, I mean, or this could mean like somebody won't open their heart to you. No, uh, so keep going. Something that's not been going on for a while. Yeah, I feel like maybe you closed your heart off to this person. Or this person closed their heart off to you because of this. 
and now you're trying to get them to open their heart, but it's like, uh, they won't do it because they have somebody else now. Or, yeah, they got somebody else they, they care about. Let's see. Mm. So either, it's, I'm, I don't know. I'm really not feeling like it might be a person. I feel like it's things. They just, like, put their head into things more to get out of the situation, you know? Okay, so, uh, I don't know, it's, this just makes me feel like you need to accept what you did, and if you're gonna stick around, just be aware of the consequences of what you've done, like, they, you did it to them, now they have to do it to you, well, they don't have to, but it's possible that it's going to be done to you, so it's like accept it or move on, okay? All right, Cleo cards. Read these straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. All right, what's going on? Okay, so the food card jumped out. To me, this says somebody is starting to plan something. All right, what's going on for the cancer? Cancer, cancer. What's going on for the cancer? Four. August 8th through the, no, August 7th through the 13th, 2017, love reading. Okay, King of Coins. So I feel like somebody is being turned down for money or just somebody just being real nasty, a nasty boss. Very controlling with the money situation. 8, 7 through 13, 2017. Or the cancer. Oops. Sorry, guys. All right. Mm. Yep, that's that choice. To deal with it or pick up your stuff and go. It's like, you know, they got something stewing up over there. You know, it might be a third party situation, but it's like, are you going to sit here and stand your ground? I mean, because you had the third party in the past, you was having a party over there, but now that your partner is doing, you got a choice or are you going to stay or are you going to leave? Feel like you're going to pick up and leave, although you've done this to them in the past, but it's like, mm. I'm not taking this. All right, so it's like, it's time to read. All right, what's going on with the page of staffs? All right, the page of staffs is upright. It says, a good person, but sometimes egotistic. Mm. Someone may bring you important news. Listen to it. Uh, a truthful person. So I feel like somebody about to come tell you what's going on. Like, if it's just... um work or is another relationship i feel like you're about to be told about this okay yep all right so we got three cups three of cups three of cups all right so a problem has been solved it is now time to celebrate enjoy the moment favorable outcome so it's like yeah, you're getting ready to figure out what's going on. Like I said earlier, in some cases, it may just be this person is um, really contemplating what to do here. You know, I think they may have some suspicions or found out about what you've done in the past. And, you know, it's choices between both of y'all. Like, am I going to sit here and stay and deal with this? Or um, am I going to leave? You know, I feel like somebody going to up and leave. But I feel like right now, at the moment, your partner is trying to um, just work on different projects projects to decide what they want to do with what you've done but general reading it could be going vice versa all right so the two of coins is be careful in any papers you may sign make sure you understand the offer that is extended to you so it's basically make sure you understand what you do because i feel like once you leave there's no coming back whatever the situation is it's like you can't leave and come back this situation for some reason all right, so we got the 10 staffs. It says, you will succeed after struggle.